What's up, guys? My name is on Cage Games. Welcome back to another video. Today, we are back on the TikToks. That is right. But it's not a try not to cringe, try not to laugh TikTok video. Uh, today, we're going to be going on TikTok and seeing what you guys are tagging me in on the platform. I don't use TikTok at all. All right. I, I literally don't use TikTok. I only created an account just to have one. And somehow, shout out to you guys, but you guys got my TikTok over a thousand followers and I posted nothing on there. So thank you. Let's try to get to 2000 followers. But uh, occasionally I go on, you know, just to see if I can handle the TikTok and I usually can't handle it, but I keep seeing you guys tag me in things. So today we're gonna find out what you guys tag me in. All right. So if you guys are excited, worried, drop a thumbs up. Let's get it. Bruh. Here we are on my TikTok page, Uncaged Games. This is the official. All right, this is mine. 1,000 followers, baby. Let's go. Let's get that 2,000. But uh, let's go and check what you guys have tagged me in. I'm going to go all the way to the bottom and work my way up. I have not seen any of this. I just keep seeing you guys tag me in things. So hopefully they are funny, maybe. So this one says, I got three new additions from the seventh dimension. My name's there. Hashtag Uncaged. And one day, I mean, I haven't posted in a good bit, so might as well. And plus, I... Got whoa, whoa, three whoa, things whoa, okay, let's, let's take, what, what, I didn't mean to like it, I see that he's rocking the McFarlane line down there, all right, pretty sick, pretty solid, uh, I have all those, those are, those are nice, one day, I mean, I haven't posted in a good bit, so might as well, and plus, I got, got three some of the deception figures, my Mortal Kombat collection, so I got Johnny Cage, hey, I had that, deception, oh, no, sorry, <laughs> Shadow Monks, Monks. comics done with the Kano deception, Kano is awesome, and then we got Scorpion, which is cold and so Holy, did he pay $95 for that? Funko Pops, and we got Raiden. I think I saw $95 on the price tag. $55? Holy crap. Yo, I bought my Raiden for like 10 bucks and my Sub-Zero and uh, Scorpion for like, I think, 20 The price shot up. Exclusive, <laughs> we got Crazy. Exclusive. And this one's only at GameStop. So, yeah. These are not the Funko Pops that we're talking about. The movie ones haven't came out yet, so once the movie ones came out yet, I'll collect those Funko Pops. Oh yeah, and I also got this uh, limited edition Wonder Woman, because why not? I mean, if it's limited edition, limited edition. Okay. Overall, I think his collection's pretty solid. I like the way he has it lined up. I don't know if him paying $55 for that Raiden Pop and 95 for that Scorpion Sub-Zero 2-pack was worth it. I think that might have been a little bit of a oopsie daisies on his part but uh yeah all right i decided to flip my webcam to this side because then you guys get more of a, a viewing experience on that side so uh, let's check out the next thing that we've been tagged in which one is your favorite they spelled witch wrong pretty sure that's copyright music um so that's like dragon ball z i think it's pretty cool all right all right action figure art here Using that, I don't know what it's called, but like that light. I would probably say that's my favorite. It actually looks like he's doing Kamehameha. Uh, pretty cool. Did not expect to get tagged in a Dragon Ball Z thing. Oh, this person tagged me in a lot of things. Okay. What's this? Wait, is this just them tagging me in a whole race they do in Mario Kart? What was that? What, what, what was that? Um... I don't, I don't, okay, let's just, let's just go to the next video. This video gets a negative four on the rating scale. And just for that, I'm not even watching the, the next two, thi two things you tagged me in. This is already going great. Proving any song goes with this fatality, part nine. <laughs> I'm probably gonna get copyright for that. Proving any song goes with this fatality, part nine. Does it? I mean, it's, it's not bad. It hyped me up, but I'm not, I'm not impressed. Next. Send to your second at and say nothing. I'm kind of scared. Under the sheets, under the sheets. Me and your mother making your brother under the sheets. I'm now reminded why I don't use TikTok. Tag someone you know is famous and won't reply. Why you tag me? I hate TikTok so much. <laughs> it's the worst. Oh yeah, yeah, I saw that. Who, pu who punched Lizard? Uh, of course it's Flash Thompson, dude. He hit you in a flash. Awesome movie, by the way. 
Fantastic movie. Love it. If you have not watched Spider-Man No Way Home yet, go watch it. This is what your favorite Mortal Kombat character says about you. All right. I'm, I'm intrigued. Favorite one of these says about you. Okay. You're choosing the safest option. Maybe a little bit overrated, but it's still a good one. Okay. Is this one your favorite because it's good, or are you just really horny? I don't know. All right. We get it. You like this one. This may not be everyone's favorite, but it's yours, and you're totally chill about it. You're into the classics. All right. What's Johnny? You're old. You're really old. Your social security number is two. You are one pretentious hipster. Officer, it's this one right here. Oh, you're cool. I like you. No way. You actually know that one? Can we be friends? This one's just a phase. You'll grow out of it when you grow up. Maybe this is a try not to cringe video. I don't know. Oh, look, we got we got tagged by this guy again. I wonder what, what magical... Uh, tell me your favorite song in the comments and I'll rate it. Can I untag myself from this? You could have this house with this gaming setup. The gaming setup's not even that impressive. Unlimited money. Okay, that's good. But you have to live here with your first at. Are you staying? Oh, so I was there. I mean, I, I feel like I'm not that bad to live with. So, um, sure. <laughs> let's, let's, I mean, the house looks bit unlimited money though. Come on. Wait, D D and D minis advent calendar. Oh my goodness. They bought the thing I bought. This person <laughs> bought the same, uh, Mortal Kombat advent calendar. Flashback. Let me show you what the calendars look like. Bruh. Now, tell me, does this look like Mortal Kombat to you? End of flashback. Oh my goodness, I can't wait. Here we go. What what okay. crap did they get? <laughs> Advent calendar that's supposed to be D and D minis. And I already oh, we, we already opened a couple, so it came like this. So obviously we're a little confused what it was. I don't know why it's in Seahawks pick. <laughs> I didn't. Um, I don't know why my but, game oh, with what it came with. Day one. <laughs> like, yeah, yeah, she's all right. She's all right. Oh, oh, they got a Smurf. <laughs> I wish I got a Smurf. D and D Smurfs. Right, day three. Oh my God, that's actually from Dragon Slayer. Uh, Demon this Slayer. person got a lot cooler cool items than I did. That's actually kind of cute, but not D and D. Okay, day four. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! She looks fucking rough. Oh man. I'm glad I'm not the only one that got Shit. scammed by this. Oh my god. Open day five. Right here. Open it. Right, here, right, here. right here. Right here. Oh, there is. <laughs> it's not even numbered. What is that? Oh man. Good times. Good times. I Dude, this person got way yeah, better items than I did. Somebody's garbage. <laughs> Are you serious? I got so many fucking I'm spurs. jealous, dude. <laughs> I'm so jealous. Oh, this one's still in the package. I think this is like a McDonald's toy. <laughs> it's a tiny truck you can put together. I'm jealous. <laughs> you, your mystery box <laughs> advent counter thing was way better than mine. Goodness gracious. But I'm, I'm glad that... I, I'm not the only one that got scammed, but honestly, it's pretty funny. It's it's pretty funny when you watch it. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Demonetization, demonetization, what? Don't look! Following back every single person who presses the plus button and likes this video. After you've done that, comment a red heart in the comment section. Whoa! And tap that share button, share it with two of your friends. That's sick! You. you didn't have to zoom in the, the chesticles there, but wow. I'm not going to do any of that, but that art's cool, though. Really, really sick. Did you know... What's your most viral video in 2021? Okay. Did you know if you drill deep enough into a stick? You just got Nick caged. <sighs> We're back to the cringe. Uh, we're back to the cringe. What would you do for $1 billion? A. Swim 1km through a pool of dead bodies. Oh my goodness. B. Beat your fourth at in a boxing match. C. Fly on a plane filled with 500 poisonous snakes for two hours. D. Live with the first at you suggested after you follow me. Probably do the boxing match, honestly. The boxing match probably seems the, the least worse out of all this, right? 
Oh, am I tagging this because I was the person's fourth at? So I'm, I'm guessing I'm boxing someone. Can we do like we boxing? Is that cool? TW, discussions of nudes being, what the? David Cage is also generally viewed his own work, the way film bros. Oh, they're talking about a different David Cage. <laughs> while scrolling through Twitter, I was reminded of the existence of David Cage. And as a result, I need to explain to all of you how much I hate David Cage. Yeah. If you're one of the few fortunate people who don't know who the Quack. f*** David Cage is, huh? unfortunately, I'm about to explain it to you. Okay, explain. All I really have to do to explain to you how much I hate David Cage okay. is explain what his company did to what company? Page. Wait. But before I get into that, let me actually explain who David Cage is. Okay, explain. I don't even know. David Cage is responsible for the creation of a game company, and I use game very loosely here. When did I create a game company? Here, a uh, company called Quantic Dreams. They're known me. for three games, although they've developed a total of five over the course of 20 years. Okay. The three games you might have heard of are Heavy Rain, yeah, I've heard of it. Becoming Human oh, that and game, Beyond Two Souls. Sure. That last one particularly is important to this story. Uh -huh. Now, the thing you need to know about David Cage is that David Cage does not want to make video games. He wants to make movies, specifically movies that... I want to be in movies. ...seem like high art. The problem with that is that David Cage is bad at all three. I am pretty bad. And for the record, like, I'm not here to sit and, like, gatekeep what it means to be a video game. There are lots of games that push the... Why does he look like he has to go to the bathroom? It's kind of like he's doing his leg thing where he's, like, putting his knees together. Like, he has to go to the bathroom really bad, but he has to film this TikTok or he's going to forget what he's going to say. Anyways, I think I'm done watching this video. He's talking about different David Cage. I've actually got tagged by a lot of people on Twitter saying, uh, I thought this was you, but they're talking about this. Uh, game developer that is in hot waters for something. I don't really know. Boundaries. Mortal Kombat on the violin? I'm intrigued. Okay. All right. Ooh. Ooh. All right. Okay. Okay. That was sick. I'll actually give that a like. I don't really like any. I think this is my first like on my on my TikTok account. That was awesome, dude. That was that's pretty sick. Again, there, on TikTok, there's like out of a thousand things, you might find one golden nugget. Oh, I got so so that was my second liked TikTok, uh, I ever done, or my second TikTok I've ever liked. This is my first one. It's a classic. See how they react. Oh no. Mom. My food is gone. It's too cute. My food is gone. Oh man. Give the four kids some food. Oh no. It warms my heart. What happened? It's too cute. It's too cute. Mom, what happened? I don't know. <laughs> That's okay. That's okay. Oh no, it's not. I'm gonna go get your food right it's now. It's too cute. Stuff like that I like on TikTok. Who would you let sit on you for two bill? What in the? Wait, did they just tag? Wait, what? Hold up. <laughs> Do I? Want I'm so confused. <laughs> I don't. I don't. I don't know how I feel about that one. Fake blood. Cool. YouTube. This is fake blood. No demonetization. Okay. <clears throat> My most iconic cosplay, Melina. Let's see. But it's very good, uh, very good cosplay there. Uh, and I think that's all the mentions I have. So, uh, cool. Very awesome. But all right, that is the end of this. I don't even know what to call this video. Uh, I thought it was just going to be, what are you guys tagging me on TikTok? But this turned out to be kind of a try not to cringe, but not really. So I don't really know what we're going to title this video. Uh, maybe it's going to be called Expose Uncage or Expose David Cage. I don't know. So hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you guys did, drop a thumbs up. Uh, if you guys have TikTok and you guys see some cool things on TikTok, tag me and I might do another one. But please don't tag me in the cringe. Goodness, that was, that was, uh! Like the video if you guys enjoyed. Subscribe to the channel if you guys are new. Mine's Uncage Games and you just got Cage. The face is Scorpion. Get over here. Super iconic line. So Scorpion out of all characters has
to be in multiverse. The second character could be a little more lenient. It could be Sub-Zero. Sure. 